So today behind me, I've got an x -Tour Atlas. So it's a 19.6 full off-road family van, twin bunk. It's sitting on Cruise Master Air suspension and it's got a whole bunch of goodies. So let's have a little bit of a walk through and show you what we've put on this van. One of the things I love about these x tour caravans is that the chassis, which is built by Road King down in Melbourne, they are all rated at four and a half ton chassis. Now, this van's only rated at three and a half ton, but you know that with that extra rating that it is built to withstand everything that you're gonna throw at it. It's also got, as standard, complete bash plates right up underneath, so all the water tanks are covered, everything's protected for when you're doing those off-road trips. It's got a ton of water storage, grey water storage as well. This one is on Airbag Cruise Master ATX suspension and it tows and it drives an absolute dream. So standard on the x vans, they come with the Road King alloy wheels wrapped in a BFG all-terrain, which is a really nice standard feature. They've got built-in recovery points on the rear. You can have these chassis in galvanized, painted, Raptor, whatever you decide when you're building the van with us. The Cruise Master airbag suspension system is in this toolbox at the back here. Now you can just go on coils. Like I said, this one's on airbag and then you've got the option to go with the self-leveling side of that kit. Really nice when you pull up to camp and instead of getting chocks out and that sort of thing, you can just and level your van out nice and quick. Walking down the side of the van, we've got the big pull-out awning, which is great. We've got a tunnel boot, which this one has twin bunks on this side. I like that because uh, if it's raining and the kids are sleeping, it's super hot in summer, something like that. Uh, you've got these windows open underneath the awning side of the caravan. So, you, you know, the weather's not coming in on the kids. This tunnel boot goes through to the inside of the van where you can access it um, from the middle, which is under those bunks. We've got an entertainment hatch on this side and a fold-out table. Now you've got your fusion stereo, which is accessible outside, inside, with all your inside, outside speakers. All your 12 volt points there. I love this on this van. Uh, what we've done is we've put an Evercool 40 litre fridge in there. Look at that, it's even got cold beers in it. That utilizes some space underneath the full width um, east-west bunk, uh, sorry, main bed that's in there. And then at the front, we've got a slide-out wolf fabrication kitchen, comes right out with an induction cooker on it. That is a fantastic option. Um, we have a few different uh, kitchen options if you want to interchange that for something else or not have one at all is okay too. Inside this van, we've chosen an east-west full width bed. Now that's given us some storage in the bulkhead up on one side, and that's allowed us to fit the fridge underneath this bed on the outside, that extra Evercool 40 litre. A couple of extra fans and more USBs around the beds and the bunks, keep uh, everyone nice and cool at night. Lots of big windows. We've gone with a 400 amp hour lithium system. So they're Revolution Australia batteries. It's a Victron system, 3000 watt inverter, 800 watts of solar on the roof. So plenty of power in this fan. Opted for a diesel heater. Aircon is, is factory. We've got a 274 litre fridge that is factory in these vans and just tons of storage. Everything's customizable with your colours. So whether it's bench tops, cabinets, walls, floors, whatever it may be, you get heaps of options. We've gone with the black tapware in this one. We have a fantastic bronze package. It's got the oven, it's got the microwave. But what I really, really, really love is just the finish of these vans. Um, the guys down in Melbourne at X2I do a really good attention to detail job, which is fantastic. The internal layout in these, we can customize them. I've gone with a straight couch on this side. We can do one with a little bit of a return. We can add a full height pantry next to your fridge to give you that extra food storage. Um, heaps of lights in here. I love lots of lights and I love that they put them where you don't usually see them. Underneath the bed behind me here. I love that just for that sort of makes it feel really nice. Nice vibe at night. You've got one up around the ceiling um, and when you turn them all on at night, it's, it's bright, it's great. So to open up the space in the back of this van, just to make it feel a little bit bigger, um, we've gone with the fold back doors. Um, so that one pulls across for your toilet area. You've still got your glass one for the shower, uh, but then you've got your privacy door between the kids' beds in the main area, which is great. When this is all open, I've got plenty of space here, um, but if I'm having a shower, I'm going to the toilet, I can just close this one, have this whole area to myself to get dressed 
um, which just feels really nice when you camp in, have that little bit of extra space. We've got the twin bunks, plenty of storage back here. We've also got the washing machine at the bottom here, again, standard in these full off-road vans. More storage underneath the bunks. There you have it guys, that is a really short and sharp walk around video of this X Tour Caravan. Now Tactical Tours is your Queensland, New South Wales dealer for X Tour Caravans which are built out of Melbourne, Australia. If you're in the market for a luxury full off-road caravan, come down and see us, we'll be happy to chat and show you through our caravans on site. Hope to see you there.